What's up, everybody? Once again, it's Sean Taylor. So, strip clubs have become the A and R in hip hop, and why is that? Really, a lot of people really don't understand it, but I get it. I mean, I'm from Atlanta, but I'm gonna get real technical on you. Why do strippers run the hip hop industry? Why do they run music? Well, it's not really, really anything that weird about it. People have, you know, strip clubs. Just got this whole thing about them and everything. But when you think about it, it makes sense. Women buy more music way more than men. Music is built around women, period. Right, when people wanna to go to clubs, they got women to come in free just to get men to come in. As long as you can entertain the women, women come in. And if girls come, you best believe guys are coming. Look at this picture right here. Old man looking deep into girl's soul like, girl, you looking like a young Coretta Scott King. Trip clubs is basically like a focus group to see what women like. If this girl loves to dance to this song naked, and then the girls is coming to the club with the tight dresses and a little bit of side me hanging out, gonna love to dance to it too. It's really what Drake has built his career off of, singing to women. Even before the music through a strip club culture, women have always been the guide for popular music. That's why R&B dudes get so many girls, because their music is for the women. That's why Drake has actually made his music a little bit more R&B, and we always talk about it's for the women. And it's like that for other genres too. Hip hop basically just cracked the code, and in this weird, disrespectful, but respectful way, we saying, we need you, bitch. You know what to do, subscribe. Somewhere in the top left corner somewhere, click it, click it.